All right, this is a uh, quick video demo of this Galen Cougar 2000 CPL. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. The power button does not work on it. The power light, I'm sorry, the power light does not work on it. Um, and it is missing some of the face caps of the knobs, but all the knobs are there. Um, there's one that's replaced on the reverb pot and it's a Galen Kruger 250 ml knob and there's another one that's replaced but these other ones are just missing the colored covers so it's on right now it's on a clean channel and it's set up in stereo I'm not sure how it's gonna sound through here it is going through a power amp a stereo power amp so you're gonna need a stereo power amp to run this in stereo uh, let me turn the master up a little bit the uh, power amp is set on about 10 or 11 o'clock on the volume. So here's a clean channel. I'm using a Les Paul type guitar, Les Paul custom. Um, clean channel. The compression is on the clean channel. Got the chorus on. Some reverb. This is the uh, bridge pickup. And this is not a performance video. This is only to show that this is a working unit. And I put it on the uh, middle, middle position. Um, all right, I'm gonna put this on the neck pickup now. idea of the stereo chorus sound it's very very lush this also has direct XLR outputs that work really good so again uh, compression is on the clean channel and um, Push up, bridge, pick up. Okay, cool. So anyway, these are going through um, in stereo, two cabinets. Um. Alright, so that's the clean channel. You can see where the EQs are set. I'm going to switch over to the overdrive channel. Alright, let's see. So overdrive channel, I do have... Oh, I also do have the noise reduction on. It's set to fast, and the threshold is at 12 o'clock. Here is a uh, bridge pickup. It definitely has some nice chunk to it. Definitely has that crunchy 80s sound. The EQ on these can be tweaked out pretty, pretty good. I mean, it's very touchy and sensitive. Just a tiny little bit of 
movement on the EQs on these things really shape the sound. <laughs> So the reverb is set at about one o'clock. You can't hear that it's working. Kind of sounds like a springish, springish kind of reverb. It sounds good. Of course, you can add plenty of effects to this if you want. There are no effects added to this unit. It does have an effects loop, but right now I'm running it just straight into the preamp and then power amp. <laughs> The gain is set almost at full right now. Right now I'm switching between the bridge and the neck pickup. Uh, so again, I'm on a Les Paul Custom. <laughs> I can do to demo this thing. Just sounds nice and fat and lush and thick with the stereo chorus on. Right, I'm gonna turn off the chorus so we can hear that sound like without the chorus. Again, the overdrive channel. It still sounds fat, but we lost the stereo spread sound. Played that riff in a long time. It just makes you want to play like metal riffs when you hear this sound. Thank <laughs> you. 
say anything else. I'm going to turn the uh, uh, noise reduction off now. Let's see what this gain sounds like. No, no noise reduction. Uh, no, no real discernible noise problem. reduction back on turn the course back on go back to the clean channel uh, let's see clean channel we'll go in the neck pick up for a second here oh, that's a beautiful sound Cool guys, that's the demo. Uh, everything's working 100%. It's not the most beautiful looking unit because of the missing caps. I don't know if you can still find those, but uh, that's it.